You mean, tell physical me about bites, physical, marks, you wake okay. up seeing bites. This church was designed for you. From when they start? Months? October. From October. And what happened? Um, I was scared to death. You were scared? Yes. Because I can know when it's in my presence. I can smell it. I can feel it. The heaviness, the darkness. And it smells so bad. And whenever it comes around me, I panic. I cry. I live in fear every day. But I prayed and I prayed and I cried and I prayed. And it wasn't changing. Nothing changed. And I never gave up. Come to church, praise, or worship, sing, praise, worship, sing. Ask God when just to deliver me because I was tired. I said, God, I'm tired of the abuse. I'm tired of the abuse. And last week, Sunday, I got my deliverance. I didn't understand what was happening. I was sitting in church and I felt this heat in my body. I was hot like fire. And I thought it was the demon because normally when it's around, I'm hot. But this heat was a different heat. This one was within my body. And I turned around and asked the lady, um, are you hot? She said, no. And I'm saying, all right, then I just mean. And I was sitting there, sitting there, and I was praising, and I was praising, and crying, and thanking him, and thanking him. And something just left. I don't know what it was. I can't explain it. But something happened last week, Sunday. And I went home, and I slept. I haven't slept well in months. You haven't slept in months. So you have surrendered your life to Jesus. Sir. I've surrendered a long time. And even though I surrender every day, I ask him, God, what can I oh, do Oh, so you are more? Christian when this was happening? Yes, sir. You see what I'm telling you this morning? Then tell me about Christian people. Can't have devils and can't come under attack. When the people get delivered, you go interview them and find out if they're really safe. But all I know when we say, come out, we don't ask the question. We just want to know what is not supposed to be here. Begin to leave you. So I just want to say that something that happened to us, we don't know why some things are unexplainable and some things doctors can't help with and you have to come to church. Sickness is not of God and sickness is spirits and only the church can help with that.